at the hospital tonight after deputies say his stepdaughter shot him in the, in his garage. All this happening on Grove Landing Way in Grovetown. After the shooting, deputies say his stepdaughter, Tasha Lawrence, turned herself in. Our Nick Veland has been following this story all day long. And Nick, you spoke with one of the neighbors who says they heard and saw everything. Yeah, Laura, well, it's a normally the only complaint in this neighborhood is about parking on the street. But today at 1.30, gunshots rang, shattering the silence for the first time anyone can remember. The boom, and I was like, what was that? Seconds passed, and again. I hear two more, boom, boom. She saw what followed. And I see the woman walking out with something in her hand, getting in her car and driving away. And heard. Moans coming from the garage, like, oh, they, uh, uh, you know, you hear that, and it was just... It was scary. Tasha Lawrence says that she went to the address to bring her mom flowers for Mother's Day, but her mom never got them. She had an ongoing dispute with her stepdad. At some point, things turned violent. An incident report says that she went back to her car, got her gun, and shot him. Had those flowers in her hands. It's a little bouquet of flowers right there. And she dropped those, and she just walked. I mean, she was angry. She looked angry, just got in the car, drove right away. The flowers still there, along with the shockwave still echoing through the neighborhood. I was actually on hold with a company at the time when I got a phone call from my neighbor panicking. Jenny immediately rushed to her front porch. And was looking and seeing what was going on. I did see a gentleman in the garage on the floor with blood. The neighbors tell me that this family just moved in two months ago, so they've only had a few interactions and they've all been positive. It's in his garage a lot, just likes to, you know, watch the cars go by, wave at the kids and wave at everybody as they go by, and just a very sweet man. He was rushed to the hospital for treatment. But he was talking, he was moving around, so I hope he's going to be okay. And Tasha Lawrence is charged with aggravated assault and possession of a firearm. And she's in the Columbia County Detention Center tonight. And we're still trying to figure out what the motive is. Pretty wild story. We'll know you'll stay on top of it, Nick. Thanks.